The way we handle food plays a critical role in keeping our family safe from eating food that could be contaminated with bacteria such as Listeria, Salmonella, and E. coli, as well as other foodborne viruses or parasites. Following these safe food handling tips will help reduce your risk of food poisoning. Wash your hands and work surfaces often with warm soapy water. Wash all fruit and vegetables with cool drinkable water. Use a digital food thermometer while cooking to ensure a safe internal temperature. Since cooking times vary, you can download a guide such as the Safe Internal Cooking Temperatures Chart from the Health Canada website. Always separate your raw foods such as meat, poultry and eggs from cooked and ready to eat foods like fruit and vegetables. Always refrigerate food and leftovers promptly at 4 degrees Celsius or below. You can avoid the temperature danger zone which is 4 degrees Celsius to 60 degrees Celsius by keeping hot food hot and cold food cold. Bacteria can grow in this temperature range in as little as two hours. Although anyone can get sick from improperly cooked or handled food, eating a piece of raw or undercooked meat, for example, like steak tartare or rare steak, can put certain groups at an increased risk of foodborne illness. As we age, it becomes harder for the immune system to ward off harmful bacteria. While most people can recover completely, serious longer-term health effects, such as kidney failure and anemia, are more common in older adults. During pregnancy, both the mother and unborn child are more susceptible to foodborne illness because of the many changes taking place in the body, including a weakened immune system. Food and nutrition are the building blocks for a healthy baby, making safe food handling even more important. Some conditions and treatments can affect the immune system, making it harder for people living with serious illnesses and chronic conditions to fight off harmful foodborne bacteria. Avoid eating undercooked, raw, or unpasteurized foods. When it comes to food safety, simple steps can make a big difference. For example, when grocery shopping, buy cold or frozen food at the end of your trip. Wash your reusable grocery bags often, especially the ones used for carrying raw food. Last but not least, never use your nose, eyes, or taste buds to judge the safety of food. When in doubt, throw it out. And visit the Safe Food Handling section of the Healthy Canadians website at www.healthycanadians.gc.ca slash food safety for a comprehensive list of foods to avoid, safer alternatives, as well as more food handling, defrosting, and cooking tips.